Vyas College of Engineering and Technology is a well-known name in Jodhpur. It is registered under Rajasthan Vikas Sansthan and has stimulus environment of serene atmosphere. Its sprawling campus of 35 acres of lush green land is surrounded in pleasant climate. The founders of the trust desire to meet the technical requirements of contemporary time to serve the cause of rural and urban development. Vyas Dental College Hospital Jodhpur Oral Medicine and Radiology VIHE is the first and only institute in Western Rajasthan to offer postgraduate in dentistry in all streams. With the demand of specialization and better opportunities after post-graduation, VDCH is becoming core center for dentistry courses in Jodhpur and India. Department Oral Medicine and Radiology provide an essential link between dentistry and medicine. It is the speciality of dentistry which is concerned with the diagnosis and treatment of oral mucosal disease. Maxillofacial radiology is the speciality of dentistry concerned with the production and interpretation of images and data produced by all modalities of radiant energy that are used for the diagnosis and management of diseases. Orthopanatomography, radiovisiography are performed and is used for academic and research activities. Oral and maxillofacial surgery is the speciality which combines surgical training with dental expertise for the treatment of diseases, injuries, tumors and deformities of face and jaws and simple extraction of teeth. The Department of Oral and Maxillofacial Surgery is responsible for the didactic and clinical instruction in oral and maxillofacial surgery and local anesthesia and pain control for the undergraduate dental student. Department of Prosthodontics Prosthodontics dental speciality deals with rehabilitation and restoration of missing teeth and oral structures. In preclinical laboratory, lab procedures for fixed partial denture and complete denture are performed. In clinical lab, sterilization is maintained and steps for fabrication of complete denture, fixed partial denture and removal denture, implant prosthodontics and maxillofacial prosthodontics are performed. A well-equipped modern ceramic laboratory is attached via ceramic application, surviving of removal partial denture, casting procedure is performed. The Department of Pedodontics promotes the dental health of children as well as serves as educational resource for parents. It is important to establish a comprehensive and outgoing relationship between dentist and patient. The treatment procedures that are performed in this department includes pulp therapies followed by crowns, restorations, extractions, oral prophylaxis, etc. In this department, Kids are treated with affection and general care. Department of Conservative Dentistry and Endodontics The Department of Conservative Dentistry and Endodontics deals with conservation of tooth structure with the help of root canal treatment and recent tooth colored restorations like composite. Tooth whitening procedures with the help of light assisted bleaching are also performed in the department. Interactive sessions with undergraduates and postgraduates are regularly held in the department. Latest advances like dental operating microscope are being used regularly for diagnosis as well as treatment of complicated cases. Team of specialist doctors discusses each case before formulating the best possible treatment plan for the welfare of patient. Department has got a separate lab for making metal as well as ceramic crowns. 
The students are trained in the preclinical lab on models simulating human oral cavity before entering the clinics for treating patients. Department of Periodontics Periodontics is the field of dentistry which deals with the tissues that surround the tooth. The tissues involved include the gingiva, alveolar bone, cementum and periodontal ligament. It is very important that the patient must be motivated to a high degree of oral hygiene by proper brushing techniques. Various surgical periodontal therapies like periodontal flap surgery along with advanced regenerative procedures are being carried out. Department also provides the recent treatment modalities like microsurgery, laser therapy and dental implant. Specialized surgical instruments are utilized in periodontal therapy. It should always need to remind that the patient is the one who cares for his or her mouth on a daily basis. The Department of Public Health Dentistry deals with the promotion of oral health through art of prevention. The department has tobacco counseling room to educate people regarding ill effects and remedies to stop tobacco usage. The department has health museum containing oral pamphlets, models, charts for health education, motivation and oral health awareness. Besides all these, fluoride application and oral rehabilitative treatment is also provided. The Department of Orthodontics and Dentofacial Orthopedics deals with patient's faces, smiles and teeth. We work our best to give the patient their required dentition and restore proper function of teeth. Treatment is provided to children and adults both who suffer from irregular teeth, protrusive teeth, abnormal bite and many other similar problems to give the patient a healthy and aesthetic smile. A wide array of appliances and procedures including those of latest technologies are undertaken according to age which mainly include the fixed appliance therapy where brackets and wires are used to make the appropriate changes required. A specialized teaching program for the undergraduate and postgraduate students includes the use of latest technology to provide a sound learning environment. Department of Oral Pathology is concerned with the structural and functional changes in cells, tissues and organs of the oral cavity that cause or caused by diseases. It is field of science that has made an attempt to correlate human biology with the signs and symptoms of human diseases. Histopathology lab is well equipped with advanced semi-automatic microtome and trained technicians for the sectioning of surgical specimen to evaluate microscopic structures. Seminars, general clubs and case discussions are conducted for the effective understanding of subject and keeping the students updated with the recent advancements. Department of Anatomy Anatomy is the study of various structures and their relations in the body. Knowledge of human anatomy is the foundation stone for the BDS course. It gives an idea about the arrangement of structure in the body, its development, microscopic structures as well as its clinical importance. Nowadays when even dentists have to treat common medical problems in day-to-day -day life so they have to learn not only head and neck but other parts of the body also. Modern anatomy not only describes structure of human body but also seeks to uncover different factors that govern its development. It attempts to explain how and why an organism is formed. Besides, it also focuses on various regulatory mechanisms of the systems in the body. Physiology Physiology is the science of the functions of living system. Human physiology deals with the functions of human body. It tries to explain the specific characteristics and mechanisms of the human body 
that make it a living being. Without the knowledge of this subject, various intricate and complexities of human body cannot be understood during the physiological and pathological conditions. Thus, the goal of human physiology is to explain the physical and chemical factors that are responsible for the origin, development and progression of life. Dental Anatomy and Histology Dental Anatomy and Histology is a basic subject of dental education, one of the foundation courses in the preclinical dental curriculum. This subject, taught in the preclinical years, teaches information that students will later use routinely in their dental practice. Tooth carving is a preclinical exercise where students learn to develop psychomotor skills for restoring the teeth to proper form and function. Pharmacology Pharmacology is the branch of medical science which deals with different aspects related to drugs. Knowledge of pharmacology ensures safe, judicious department of pathology and microbiology. Pathology is the study of what and why of abnormalities of structure and functions of human body. It deals with scientific understanding of genesis of diseases and its related structural changes. In this, also histopathology remains a very important diagnostic aspect. VCET has all the major branches of engineering, namely civil, electrical, electronics and computer science. The departments individually conduct workshops, symposiums, conferences to provide a forum for the students interacting with eminent professionals from the field. We have well qualified and dedicated faculty who emphasizes on the experimental mind of the students. The campus offers updated technical labs, excellent library, Future challenges are unpredictable, so the institution prepares its students to meet the challenges of realistic world by calling professionals from industries, organizing workshops, conducting training of the upgraded technical courses. The training and placement cell functioning in the college is entrusted for guiding students, arranging industrial trainings and conducting seminars, group discussions as a part of career guidance. The Cultural Club Spark, organized every year, provides platform to exhibit the hidden talent of the students. The institution strongly focuses on the holistic development of the student. Annual Cultural Extravaganza is the prime and most awaited affair of the year every year. Spark is organized by Vyas Institute of Higher Education every year and extract extracurricular activities besides studies. It's my honor and I'm very very happy to be among such amazing students and such a fantastic energy 
You have a great, great university. <laughs> <laughs> Efficient bus facility, hostel, mess, cafeteria and well-integrated training and placement cell focusing on industrial requirements. Education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. Delhi Public School is one of the largest chain of public schools with over 167 members in India and 15 in abroad. At DPS, the purpose of education is to develop the complete child, someone who is keen to explore, has the emotional question to take everything in stride and has the social skills to interact with the world at large. As learning comes naturally to a child, it need not to be drilled or forced. We believe that the foremost duty of ours is the positive channelization of energy by encouraging them to take a part in co-curriculum activities and community involvement program. We offer them a set of academic curriculum which will lay a strong foundation with the better clarity of concepts which results in better understanding. Many choices are available with the children to develop their creativity as poetry, public speaking, cooking, clay modeling, collage, origami, cut and paste, gardening, swimming, skating, drawing, painting, calligraphy, dramatics, music, dance, enactment and recitation etc. To overcome their hesitation Interactive sessions are conducted to promote their confidence in public speaking and to develop awareness. Efforts are made to promote communication skill and also to train them to express their thoughts in a balanced manner. <laughs> 